Now, is there we're leaning into the 75th anniversary pretty hard this year, whether in the show or in the marketing of the sport. So in the 75 years, if you had to pick one guy that you want to emulate or try to grow up to be, who was that guy? Um, I mean, growing up, I was a huge Jeff Gordon fan, huge Tony Stewart fan. I would say I'm more similar to Tony, just in that I, I still race a lot of dirt stuff. So I guess, you know, emulate him some. And, and that's why, you know, I, when I build out a schedule, I'm like, what would Tony do in his prime? <laughs> like he would have wanted to race full season and cup and go race all the dirt stuff that he, that he does. And, and not only dirt, but other types of cars. So, um, yeah, I, I feel like I try to be like what he was in his prime. And, um, I think that's helped grow his fan base a lot. And I feel like it's, it's trended that way for me as well. But, um, yeah, I was always a fan of the dirt guys and, um, you know, Jeff though, like, I feel like my personality is too more similar to Tony's than it is Jeff. Like Jeff's more like proper and businessy and, and all that. Where like dude, Tony's you're just, way closer to Jeff yeah. than you are Tony. Me? Tony's crazy, dude. Well, yeah. I mean, I'm, <laughs> you're yeah, way tamer like, than him. I don't know. He, Tony's more <laughs> of a dirt guy yeah. than Jeff is, I guess is what I'm getting at. Tony just kept racing dirt like you did. Yeah. You know, Jeff was, dude, when you look back at Jeff. He's pretty freaking good in midgets and yeah. all that stuff. But, but he, he did what he had to do, and, and then when on. he moved on, he was he had moved on. Like he he had, he didn't he didn't have to go back. Yeah, not that like we had Tony or I did either, but um, I feel like it was important for for our mindsets really to to keep having fun doing that stuff.